Welcome to Inside Science TV. They power our phones, our cameras, even some of our cars. But lithium ion batteries are not always made of environmentally friendly parts. They contain metals like cobalt. Mining cobalt is expensive and consumes a lot of energy. The batteries use 30% of all the cobalt mined in the world each year. Now, a group of scientists are working on creating a greener alternative. Chemist George John says the secret ingredient is this plant root. This dye has been used for the last 3,500 years for making red dyes, especially for clothes. The dye, known as purpurin, can act like an electrode in the battery, allowing electricity to flow. It is compatible with lithium. This purpurin molecule is specifically coordinating and complexing with the lithium. Billions of batteries are being recycled to recover the cobalt metal, consuming lots of energy and releasing carbon dioxide in the process. The new green batteries would eliminate the need for mining and could be tossed in the trash. It is coming from nature. We believe it will definitely go back to nature without harming the nature. Scientists also say the dye is easy to use. This is a dye molecule but tomorrow it is going to be a throwaway battery component. And that is very exciting for us. A discovery that could provide greener power in the future. I'm Josh Lebowitz reporting. Inside Science TV. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.